Welcome back. Well, as I mentioned, we have Ken and Peggy here on behalf of the Shuffleboard Club. Well, welcome, you two. How are you today? Thank just you. Just fine. Thank well, you. Well, we know you've been on, but Peggy, welcome. But Thank tell you. us a little bit about yourself. Oh, dear. <laughs> <laughs> well, how long have you been playing shuffleboard? Oh, five, six years. Okay. Uh, have I've, you lived there that long, too? Pardon me? Have you lived here that long, too? No, I've been here 17 years. Oh, okay, great. Yeah. Well, what brought you to shuffleboard? Gosh, I don't even remember. <laughs> One of the members probably just invited me, and I decided to try it out. And so. you like it? I do. I love it. Okay. Love well, it. what do you think uh, some, of, some of the people, you know, what, what draws people to shuffleboard? I think the, first of all, the socialization. There's great people. That, and it's an easy sport. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You don't have to remember too much, right? Because right. yeah, I think that's probably hard about a lot of things. And, and not and a lot of physical. See, anybody can play it. Yeah. Right. Right. You know, I know you. I know you sent us a photo of someone who is in a is in a wheelchair, yeah. and you know I would I would imagine that you're able to like here we have a gentleman who's in a wheelchair and he is pushing. What is that thing called? A stick. Oh, stick. just like it looks, a stick. <laughs> okay, so you have a stick, yeah. and then are those considered pucks? Disc. Oh, discs, okay. All right, and tell me how the game works. Well, it's relatively simple. It's, in one sense, there's challenges to it. And stuff. Okay. But you have a disc and scoring, as you can see, a triangle there. Yes. Each triangle is worth different points. Okay. And so you try and score as many points and your person next to you is against you, so right. if you're scoring, they're trying to knock the scoring off. Oh, so it would that. replace, like your their their disc is replacing the other yeah. one. Oh, I see, okay. Are you pretty good? I think I'm <laughs> okay. I'm not a professional by any means. Well, but. no, but nonetheless, yeah. you enjoy it, and I you're do. probably pretty good at it if you play <laughs> yes. it a lot. Yeah. Now, how many members are you, do you have now? I'd say 30, 40 ish in, the, okay. in our book. There's okay. 40 people. And how many people can play at a time? Well, we have six courts. Okay. And there's, you can have four on each court. Mm -hmm. So there's, you can have 24 people play. Okay. Okay. So, That's excellent. Yeah. It's very, you know, we have room for a lot of people. Yeah. Well, look at how slick the, uh, the what court. Is it? court. It looks like a runway. <laughs> Getting all of them wrong. So the court, do you have to maintain that? Oh yes. We uh, before <coughs> each time we play, we dust the court. In other words, we take a broom and clean it all off. Okay. Sure. And then we put this dressing. It's like a silicone dressing. Spread it all over the court, which makes it oh. very. How fast. often do you have to do that? Every time we play. You know, oh like my gosh, if that sounds like a lot of Monday, work. Well, it takes a few minutes, but yeah. So the and silicone is it? What is that made? Is it like a powder or a it, liquid? Or little little pebbles. Oh. Real little. It looks pebbles. like cornmeal. Yeah. Oh, okay. And then you do, you put that on, mm -hmm. and then what do you do? You have to do you buff it off. No, after the game is over, then you, we can just sweep it off. Oh, I see. You leave it on while you play. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. interesting. Yeah. Okay. That's that's one <clears> of the, if you want to say tricks, one of the ways to. That determines how you can either push it fast or slow. Mm. It determines, you know. Okay. That's part of the challenge. Just challenge <laughs> of the game. Well, now does let me ask you this. So, the the building itself is air conditioned, right? No. Oh, it is not. No, We've got that's, fans. That's fans. you know one thing that a long time ago they tried, but okay. It never but we have fans, and it a little warm, but we have several fans okay. mounted and everything. Okay. So it, it's bearable. Tall. Okay. You know. yeah. can and the, in the wintertime we have heaters. Oh, okay, good. Can the, yeah. can the weather change the way uh, the court plays? Some people say yes, I some people so. say no. <laughs> what, what do you notice different? If it's cold, it's slower. When it's warm, it seems to go faster. Go faster. All right, mm -hmm. interesting. Yeah. And what are the uh, discs made of? They're Real, what a real hard plastic. Plastic, okay. I would think that. Yeah. That would be my okay. guess. Yeah. All right. Well, excellent. Now you guys have a you have a meeting coming up, and it's July seventh. And uh, is that sort of an invitation for people to learn? Yeah. It's okay. it's an open class. Okay. You know, and it's 
two hours on Thursday, 7th and two hours. Now you can come to both of them. Okay. Or, you know, if you only can come to one uh -huh. or the other, you know, you can, it, it's a good lesson, they, the whole strategy and safety and everything else. And, you know, along with that though, we also have on our Monday, we play Mondays and Tuesdays and Thursday evening. Okay. You can come any of that time too okay. and get a small lesson and still okay. start to learn. Yeah, okay. So now at your uh, July 7th and July 14th, which is in Clubhouse One Building C from 5.30 to 7.30, uh, basically you're gonna run through how to play the whole thing, right, mm -hmm. from start to finish? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, and then will you actually have some matches? Oh yeah. Okay, yeah. okay. Does anybody need to bring any equipment or do you have everything? Everything's provided, although we do require that people wear closed-toed shoes. Okay, now do you have to have a particular kind of bottom on them? Like no. a tennis shoe? No. 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 Okay, so it doesn't Just have to be a tennis shoe. So those shoe. hard... The, um, the reason okay. for that, because the disc at different times, sometimes you have to shoot rather hard. Fly. Oh. And it can go down. And, and hit your toe. Hit oh, ouch. Toe. Yeah, yeah so and if you said it was a heavy plastic, then it all, probably could hurt. It's yeah. all, all part of the safety. Okay, excellent, excellent. Is there anything anybody else should know about shuffleboard that we haven't told them? Just that, you know... Anybody can play it. Okay, there's, and it's there's fun. There's really no restriction. We've had right. some physically handicapped people. We've mm -hmm. had people in walkers, and as you can see, Steve yeah. with the wheelchair. So uh, there's no reason not to play. Now, how do you? Now I know you keep score. Yes. Uh, what's the What's the highest score you need to achieve? Well, if you're playing as a team, it's how high you're, just whoever has the highest score at the wins. End of the day. Okay. Yeah. There's okay. not a certain point that you ought to Now, do you write down the score or do you have to memorize it? <laughs> Nothing. You just walk away. <laughs> there's, a, there's a board that oh, we Oh, there's keep. a board. Okay, oh, well, perfect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. At the perfect. end of the day, we aren't keeping no, 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 no. track. So, do you ever have tournaments? Oh, yes. Oh, okay. Awesome. In fact, tonight, every, uh, well, I want to say quarter, Three times a year. Three or yeah. four times. We have tonight, there's a, they call it a jackpot tournament, where we have different style games, and I think there's pizza tonight. Yes. And this and that. So, and then we have, throughout the year, a few times, a dinner with, then we play different games at dinner and stuff, so. Perfect. Some of those details of that event is we abandon all the normal shuffleboard rules and play something totally different. Tonight's event, we're going to put a chair in the middle of the court. Mm. So you got to wiggle your way around the legs of those chairs. And <laughs> so that'll be a challenge to score. Exactly. exactly. So that's just one type of, type of odd game we play once in a while. <laughs> I love it, though. You know, it, it, you, you have lots of people who love to play. And of course, new people are always welcome. And uh, I appreciate you guys sharing the information with me. Well, we appreciate you and letting us present this yes. to the village. Yeah, you we, hope I, we hope we increase our membership. Absolutely. Great. And it, and for the membership, it's just $15 a year. Perfect. Oh, that's right. Good. Mm -hmm. Well, that's probably to pay for the pizza. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thanks so much. Thank you. All right. Thank you. If you want more information about the Shuffleboard Club, you can go to our LagunaWoodsVillage.com website and search shuffleboard club and that will give you all the information we'll be right back